Well guys, for one I got some good news. It's now 1.40 in the afternoon, so at least I'm waking up slightly earlier. <laughs> Still so bad. I actually woke up at about like 1.15 and then I decided I wanted to eat food before recording this video. So yeah, before recording this video that you guys asked for. I mean, hey, I got a lot of comments saying, hey, yes, please play Ghost this one time and then try Advanced Warfare later. And I'm just like, okay, if you say so. But anyways, fuck it. That's besides the point. Today we are playing Call of Duty fucking Ghosts on the PC. There's nobody in drop zone, which is really unfortunate. I mean, granted, not to mention there is only uh, just a little under 600 players that are playing this game worldwide, most of which are European players. So anyways, I suppose with that being said, uh, we're just going to go into regular team deathmatch, and uh, yeah, let's just see how this goes. Just this fucking game. I mean, like, I will say this. It does look pretty good on PC. I will give it that, but it still does not change the fact of just how, oh my god, this fucking game is so cringy at times. I think, if anything, this was one one of like the most anti-climatic Call of Duties that has ever been released to date. You see, me personally, I was excited as shit for Ghost. I thought that this was going to be just a great fucking game, but no. Overall, it's not a terrible game. It's just, uh, all right, there's a couple of things that they really needed to change with this fucking game. For one, you die too fucking quickly. For two, the maps are way too fucking big. I still believe if you were to put like Call of Duty 4, MW2, maybe even MW3 maps into this game, and this game would be pretty good as far as the maps go. And then comes the shit with like the riot shield and the IEDs and the noob tubes. Oh yeah, the satcoms. Those are some really dumb shit in this fucking game. And the knifing animation. Yeah, but look at this shit. Riot shield with radar. Like truly this game, it's like, it had the potential to be really good, but of course they fucked it up. Look at this shit. Riot shield, oh my fucking God. Also, if you guys notice the guy running around in the back, that also pissed me off too. The fact that you can have a ghillie suit on but not be using a sniper. I couldn't even begin to tell you guys the amount of times like how excited I was seeing people in ghillie suits like holy shit people are actually sniping then all of a sudden no they're running around with a fucking LMG. Oh yeah the thermal LMGs with a fucking suppressor in this game is absolutely fucking ridiculous. I don't even know how long I've been recording this video. I'm pretty sure I've been recording less than at least five minutes at this point in time and I'm pretty sure I've already done at least two and a half minutes worth of bitching. <laughs> That's such a sad thing to say. Yeah the fucking satcom you gotta place three of these bitches down. I really don't know what the fuck they were thinking with that but just I, I don't know I don't understand what was wrong with the original UAV or something like that and then we got people sitting in the back of the map sit the fuck down this game truly could have been a really well put together game but just there were so many things that they just did completely wrong that really turned everyone off to the game see now this is one of the things that I thought that was kind of cool I mean like sniping from the helicopter that was kind of cool all right hold on we're tied at 72 I swear to god if we lose this shit fuck all right. no shit fuck no, we're about to lose. We are about to fucking lose. God, fuck, shit. Ugh, I hate losing games like that, especially when it's within, like, five kills. That shit drives me crazy. Wait, let's see this shit. Hold on. No, wrong person. Favorite weapon, USR. Victories, nine. Games played, 11. So I have a 4.5 win loss. I've only lost two fucking games. Deadpool, pussy camper cry a bit. Yeah, that's another thing in this game. The amount of people that actually camp is fucking unreal, which to an extent is the reason why I play so much drop zone when it comes to MW3 and Call of Duty Ghosts. And unfortunately enough, there's literally nobody playing drop zone in this game. 10th Prestige 60 using a fucking riot shield. Good fucking god. Yeah, I've always noticed that it's the 10th Prestiges in this game that play like the biggest bitches. A good majority of them are the ones that run around with the LMGs and riot shields and IEDs and shit. I'm gonna play this last match here on Octane, like one of the only, maybe two, three good maps in this fucking game. And also now that I'm thinking about it, I truly cannot believe that I'm just now recognizing this. What the fucking kill feed? Up in the upper right hand corner is the most irritating fucking thing ever. I still can't believe it took me that long to even mention that. Keep running out of there. Please. No, no, okay. You know, I just want to point out the fact that this game has been going on for a near six minutes and the enemy team still hasn't broken 40 kills yet. Oh yeah, the fucking squad members. Oh, I can't believe I'm just not mentioning this. Those are the worst kill streaks to ever be brought into a Call of Duty. The fucking support squad mates, dude, fuck these guys. You know what? I I'm not sitting through the rest of this. There's a little under three minutes left. We still haven't broken 50 kills. I'm just, I'm leaving this shit. This is actually fucking boring. <sighs> well, so, um... Yeah, that was Call of Duty Ghosts on the PC. Uh, this would have been a much more enjoyable video if I could have played fucking Drop Zone, but there's still nobody fucking in it. It could have been so much better. This game truly could have been so much better. So, 
Yeah, uh, there's my video on Call of Duty Ghosts. I have a much, much better idea for a video going up tomorrow on Monday, and then later on I'm going to be downloading Advanced Warfare, and that'll probably go up later on in the week as well. So, uh, yeah, if you're still here watching this video, um, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you guys did, please leave a thumbs up to, uh, I don't know, help me with my depression and, uh, the amount of boring that I just put myself through. The fucking boredom. Boredom, yeah, I suppose I could say that. Just, dude, like, honestly, I would have much rather watched fucking paint dry than play this shit. But, I mean, hey, you guys wanted it, you guys asked for it, so, hey, there you go.